of those tornadoes are Dallas area students. Three schools so heavily damaged, thousands of kids are now attending different campuses. Today, it was the students of Thomas Jefferson High School who didn't have to worry about tornadoes today. Dallas Cowboys owner Jerry Jones pushing away storm clouds in a special way. Patriots of Jefferson High played their homecoming game despite the fact their home remains broken and battered. Another damaged casualty from Sunday's tornado. Watching Jefferson play at Lowe Stadium today, Dallas Cowboys owner Jerry Jones, and he brought with him a little something special for this team, these students, this school. The Dallas Cowboys and the National Football Foundation want to give $1 million to give the field back. Yes, that's a $1 million check. Funds to help Jefferson's athletic facilities and other damaged sections of the school. It's more than a field. Uh, it is about community. And of course, community never stands taller when you help out when others have been distressed. The donation became the highlight of the day after a week of distress for students who not only don't have their campus, some of them have lost their homes. I was telling them that some, these kids will never forget Sunday night and Monday morning, but they will also never forget Saturday morning just a week later. The one thing we did not want is for them sitting at home wondering what was going to happen, and no one wants their homecoming ruined. And the Cowboys, not only they made it the most special event of their lives, probably. And Jefferson didn't win that homecoming game. That is just the sad part, if you will. But how about this? Dallas Mavericks owner Mark Cuban says he will match the Cowboys' $1 million donation, and the school district can use that money to assist other schools also impacted by the tornado. That is in addition to Cuban's original $100,000 donation.